Hi guys, today we're going to find the least common multiple of three numbers. This is slightly different than what we did yesterday with only two numbers. I'm going to find the least common multiple of the numbers 10, 18, and 24. In order to do this, I'm going to remember two words, the words share and pair. I'm going to ask myself first, is there a prime number that all three numbers share? Again, all three numbers share. The answer is yes, because they're all even, the prime number 2 can come out of all of them. 10 divided by 2 is 5. 18 divided by 2 is 9. And 24 divided by 2 is 12. Now again, I'll check with my sharing. Is there any prime number that all three of these numbers share? The answer to that question is no. So now I'm going to use the word pair. Is there a prime number that is even in a pair of these numbers? Remember, pair means two. So is there a prime number that can go into even two of these numbers across the bottom? Yes, the number 3 can go into both 9 and 12. So we're going to use the number 3. Since 5 divided by 3 is a decimal answer, we're going to leave it alone and just bring the 5 down. So the 5 is just brought down. 9 divided by 3 is 3. And 12 divided by 3 is 4. Now, are there any prime numbers that can go into 5, 3, and 4? The answer is no. So now I'm done. My least common multiple, remember, I use the number both on the left and at the bottom. It should look like an L. Notice the L shape I create with my bubble. So I'm going to use 2 times 3 times 5 times 3 times 4. This will give me the least common multiple of the numbers 10, 18, and 24. So the smallest number that can go into that 10, 18, and 24 can go into. So again, use your calculators. That's why we have asked you to bring them all week. So 2 times 3 times 5 times 3 times 4. I got 360. 360 is the smallest number that 10, 18, and 24 will go into evenly. I hope this helps. Again, if you need extra practice, please ask your math teacher. We're here to help. Thanks.